According to the report, Megan had a much wilder life in Los Angeles before landing her role on Suits than anyone knew. They claimed Megan hung around with a hard partying crowd and had a few run-ins with the law during her struggling actress days that were quickly covered up. The most shocking allegation was that Megan was actually arrested once for shoplifting over $1,000 worth of merchandise from a high-end boutique in Beverly Hills. The show said police reports and court documents proved Megan tried to steal seven expensive dresses, two pairs of designer shoes, a handbag, and some sunglasses from the shop one night after a drunken night out with friends. When she attempted to leave without paying, security stopped her and called the authorities. Megan was taken into police custody, where she spent the night in jail until being bailed out the next morning. Somehow, all records of this arrest were wiped from police databases and court records were sealed to hide the incident. The tabloid host explained they believe Megan used connections with powerful Hollywood lawyers and agents to have it covered up so it wouldn't damage her budding acting career. But they had inside sources come forward finally willing to share what they knew. Viewers were shocked by these never-before-heard claims, but there was more bombshell information to come. The show went on to say they also received tips Megan had been arrested a second time, this time for drunk and disorderly conduct after getting into a wild brawl at a popular Hollywood nightclub. Apparently, Megan got into a physical fight with another female patron after having one too many drinks. The two women threw punches, knocked over tables, and shattered a glass window before security broke it up. Both women were arrested and spent the night in jail, but once again, all records were wiped clean of the incident. The tabloid host expressed outrage over how Megan was able to seemingly get away with these crimes and have any evidence of wrongdoing completely disappear thanks to her powerful connections. They felt the public deserved to know who they were really welcoming into the royal family. Viewers were equally shocked that someone with this type of criminal past could end up a princess. Of course, many have pointed out these are just allegations with no real proof presented. Megan and her team immediately denied the claims, calling them ridiculous tabloid gossip with no truth behind them. They threatened legal action against the show for defamation of character. Still, the bombshell report has Megan and the royal family scrambling to do damage control. Since the segment aired, there's been no official police comment on the veracity of these allegations or why records would be scrubbed so cleanly. But new unnamed sources have supposedly come forward corroborating parts of the story to other tabloids, keeping the sordid claims alive. Even if these particular allegations prove to be unfounded tabloid fiction, many still feel Megan hasn't been fully honest about her past. People wonder what else could be hiding in her background if serious criminal records can just disappear. It shattered her pristine image and cast doubt that she's as wholesome as portrayed. The real kicker is that the story has spiraled globally, with headlines in royal gossip rags and newspapers across Europe and the Commonwealth. You can bet the Queen is not impressed seeing one of her adopted family members associated with criminal behavior, even if unproven. It's a massive embarrassment for the monarchy at a time when public favor was already declining after Megxit drama. Clearly, Meghan is frantic to contain this story and restore her reputation. She and Harry have reportedly lawyered up, sending major cease and desist letters threatening lawsuits left and right. Prominent women's rights groups are speaking out in her defense too, saying this reeks of misogyny and racism intended to tear down a strong female POC royal. However, many critics argue the couple forfeited their privacy by choosing to leave the working family while still wanting royal titles and perks. The public deserves full transparency on who represents the monarchy, especially given their lucrative Netflix deals and constant preaching. So will more salacious details emerge to confirm aspects of this story? Or will Team Meghan win the media battle? Only time will tell how this saga unfolds, but one thing is clear. Meghan's carefully crafted image now has major cracks. Even if she emerges victorious in dispelling these specific allegations, Many people may now view her with more skepticism and question what other skeletons remain in the closet of her pre-Harry life. It could seriously impact her future roles and reputation moving forward regardless. In the end, while we may never know the full truth about Meghan's past, this scandal proves image and reputation are everything for public figures. 
especially within the rigid norms of the monarchy. One sensational story can cause lasting harm, even if unsubstantiated. It will be fascinating to see how Meghan and Harry try regaining control of the narrative from here. Thanks so much for tuning in to get the latest on this massive royal scandal, guys. Be sure to subscribe and hit that bell icon so you don't miss any future breaking updates.